Well, people sounding off tonight about doping allegations against cyclist Lance Armstrong, plus a Florida girl denied from going to homecoming because of an overdue library book. Yeah, but a lot of people had a lot to say about the U.S. Senate race. Here he is tonight's Voice of the People. How come all these so-called friends of his are now coming forth after all this time saying that he was doping? Why didn't they bring it up during the races where they lost and he won? Think about that, people. This poor girl is being punished because she has one overdue book, that she's not able to go to the homecoming dance. You got kids in schools carrying guns, threatening people, fighting, skipping school, and you're going to condemn a girl for an overdue book? I think that's ridiculous, and the school needs to get their priorities straight. I wonder how many other people besides myself either turn the voice off on all these political commercials or use that time to leave the room and do whatever else you need to. I think it's a shame that in a great state like Connecticut, we can't find someone more honorable than either McMahon or Murphy to run for the Senate. It's sad that I have to decide my vote based on which one is the less horrific liar. I sure wish there was another option. If you really want to do something to get people to, to vote for them, do something good with your money instead of just using it in a mudslinging contest between each other. I think they'll find the results a lot more beneficial for both of them.